everybody this is the second part in the devlog for the space game um i'm here testing with a friend nicholas and we're going to demonstrate the um the usage of random vpn t as a uh simulated local network for multiplayer and on top of that we're going to show the um features that have been implemented since the last update on april 20th I wasn't able to make very many because we were busy with school, but now that summer started, we're able to get much more progress done. If I bring this down, you'll see that now there's a GUI instead of having a console text input for um, configuring the game. I'm going to start it as a server, and then I'm going to have Nicholas connect to me after I enable public and private networks for the app. Okay. So Nicholas, you're going to click on the client button and you'll see it's just a blank white screen, but you can type stuff in. You're going to type in the IP address 26.182.91.18. Now we should see a connection from here, nevcomp. There we go. Now you'll see he can move around. He can shoot bullets and he can take damage. If we slow down a bit, we can go ahead and see um, more clearly taking damage so we can demonstrate the projectile system. So you'll see above the player there's a number of deaths that they have and an HP count and once that HP count reaches zero you regen back to 1000 and your death, incre your death tally increases by one. Okay, now to prove that this isn't a fluke, um, I'm going to shut the server down, and Nicholas, you're going to confirm to me that the application closes on your end? Mm -hmm. The application has closed. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and reopen, um, reopen the program, but I'm going to run it in a client configuration this time, and this time, Nicholas is going to run it in a server configuration. So Nicholas, just let me know whenever you've connected, and I can demonstrate that it works. Uh, I have connected. Okay. So now that I start client, I'm going to type in his uh, Radman address. So his is 26.213.123.14. I should make it known that because this is a VPN, this is not your actual IB feed. IPv4 address, but rather this is one that Radman has provided for you for ease of access. So if I press enter, you'll see that I connect into his game. Awesome. So Nicholas, if you can go ahead and close the server by going and just exiting out the program, we can demonstrate that it'll, on server shutdown, all the clients will be disconnected and forced to close their programs. So you'll see that without input um, on my end, but rather from Nicholas's end, he was able to close the server and as a consequence, have all the other programs that are connected to it shut down. That was pretty much the extent of what I've gotten done in the past few days. Um, if you would like to see more, you can expect a, hopefully a lot more over the summer to come. Uh, after doing this, you can just delete the network and close the program for Radman and it should be alright. And yeah, that should be all. Like I said, you should expect more updates to come over the summer, maybe with some more friends. Um, if you like this video and you would like to see more coming up, then please like and subscribe, um, share this to a friend, and yeah, that's about it. See y'all. Have a good summer. Happy Pride Month.